Here's an amazing trick. If you and your teammates are stuck outside the zone and find a coop, make one of your teammates stand exactly in the center like this. Now you can boost and drive your vehicle at any speed and your teammate won't fall. This also works with the buggy. You can drive it at any speed and your teammate won't fall. This even works with long jumps such as these. Here's a cool way to save yourself from mollies. When an enemy throws a molly towards you, just move towards the corner of the room. There is a good chance that you won't be affected by it. Here's one more example. Most players believe that the glass in the buildings will protect them from the first hit. That's not actually true. If you hit someone standing behind glass, the glass will break and will also damage the enemy. Here's the POV from the other side. If your dossier gets stuck on some building or rock and you're unable to move it, just ask one of your teammates to change the skin. That's it. Now you can freely move it. Here's a cool trick to climb over this warehouse near Pochinki. Just park your UAZ in a slanted way. Now just jump in between the gap while looking towards the warehouse. Keep jumping to climb onto the top. Now wait for your enemies and take them down easily. Here's a quick glider tip. If you run out of fuel while you're riding the glider, rather than bringing it down instantly, just keep going. And when it's about to come down, press the ascend button to give it an extra boost. This will help you fly some extra distance. Here are two ways to hide in water. Firstly, we'll use a coupe. Just run it into the water and wait for a few seconds. As you can see, the vehicle comes slightly up. This way you won't lose health while being underwater. You can change your seat to equip your weapon. Secondly, you can use a buggy and run it into the water in this manner. As you can see, you don't lose any health and you change the seat to surprise and finish your enemy. There are a lot of gaps in between the boxes in TDM. You can take advantage of those in this manner. Number one. Two. three, and four. Here's a bonus trick. If the zone is towards Novo, you can camp over this petrol bunk. Just climb over this broken vehicle and jump towards the roof in this manner. Now just position yourself and jump onto here. That's it. Wait for your enemies and take them down easily. Here's an amazing hidden feature. Click on this button. Four options pop up. By default, it's set to idle. If you select free to team up, your friends can invite you to play. If you select do not disturb, no one can invite you. Finally, if you select the stealth mode, you can become invisible. In this manner, you'll show as offline to your friends. If you're inside the school apartment and an enemy is camping below you, just jump out of any window on the side while keeping your joystick towards the back. This way you get directly into the floor below and hence you can surprise your enemies. This is how smooth it looks from a different POV. 
If the zone is towards Milta Power, get yourself a buggy as we'll learn how to climb on top of this tower. Just bring your buggy like this and drive it over this platform. It'll jump and start climbing. Once you reach the top, just exit the buggy in this manner. Now you can win the fight easily as no one can spot you from here. If there are enemies camping on the other side of the school building, just go to the terrace and jump over this railing to get onto the other side of the building. Now, surprise them from behind. Here's a cool feature in the new Flora Mode. If you get knocked near this portal, just go inside this and click on the Open button. You'll automatically get revived and teleported to play a TDM match. Once the match is over, you jump out with full health. As you all know, the coupe skids a lot due to its speed. Just puncture one of its front tires. That's it, now you can drive it smoothly without any drift. This new airdrop in the Flora Mode is very useful. You can use this to climb many buildings and surprise your enemies. Here are a few examples. You can also use it for the bridge camp. or to block the entrance of a shack. This way your enemy gets trapped in the shack forever. Here's an amazing trick to climb over the roof of this building in Yasnaya. Just climb over to the top and come close to this window. Now jump onto the window and move out slightly to jump towards the roof in this manner. Wait for your enemies and finish them easily. Whenever you see two adjacent containers like this, just go near them and keep clicking the jump button. Like this, you can climb over them and get a better angle on your enemies. The UAZ has become stronger after the new update. It took 49 ammo of 5.56 to burst it before. Now it takes 60 ammo. Which makes it almost 22% stronger. Here's a fun trick. You may have noticed that there is ammo kept near this cave in the spawn island. You can actually pick these ammo up in the real game. Just take a boat and come towards the spawn island. Now pick up as much ammo as you want. Here's a bonus trick. Subscribe to Clash Universe for more such videos. Let's keep a light game of 100k. Hope you guys do it.